it means that with two hours of effort, you can lay down a strategy and a self-sustaining process that will be basically putting your job search on autopilot the rest of the way. It takes all of the decision anxiety out of it. You know exactly what you're supposed to be doing at any given moment, both for that first two hours and for the process that follows that. So by focusing on the right two hours of work, you can get a vast majority of the benefit of a job search without going through the lion's share of anxiety and wasted hours that most people encounter. As the audience for this book, the book was originally designed for MBA students, but the concepts I soon realized were applicable well beyond that. The target audience is actually any undergraduate degree holder or beyond, with a special focus on 20 and 30-somethings, but I've worked with undergrads with this process, and I've worked with very senior alumni through this process. While a career counselor here at Duke, I have been working with a number of students, and I noticed a change around the time of the financial crisis. Students seemed more overwhelmed then than ever before, and I think that's indicative of the millennial generation making a larger percentage of job seekers in the market today. The insight that drove this process was one particular student who'd done everything right her entire life. She'd gotten a, a banking offer and only to find in 2008 that Bear Stearns went under due to the financial crisis. And she lost her offer and it was too late to get an offer with any of the other banks. She came into my office and asked me what to do. And I said, great, we'll get a list of targets together. We'll figure out where you have contacts. And she said, no, stop. Don't tell me in general what to do. Tell me exactly what to do. And I thought that was an incredibly fair question, exactly what I would say in my MBA days. And I didn't have anything for her. And I went looking online to see if someone had created that process so I could be a great artist and just steal it and, and let her benefit from it. And there was nothing out on the internet either. There was no intellectual capital around how exactly to do a job search. She was overwhelmed by anxiety and depression. She had canceled her spring break plans to stay home and surf online job postings, which to me was just tragic. And I decided then I was going to create the process that would take that anxiety away. It took me years, but the two-hour job search is the product of that effort. I would say that the career books that have been in the market until now, going back dozens and dozens of years, have focused on providing advice. Advice is not accountable. My book sets out to provide instructions, which are accountable. You can try my process exactly, critique it, and change it. Books of the past have given you laundry lists of advice and told you every job seeker is different. Trial and error your way through this laundry list and figure out what works best for you. That to me seems irresponsible. Job seekers today are bombarded by information. And the last thing they need is more advice. They have plenty of advice already. What they need is instructions. What they need is something that will enable them to turn off the anxiety of having too many options, to instead focus on a process that is 80% correct or better. This two-hour job search is that starting point. It is 80% correct. It is tested with hundreds and hundreds of iterations of students that I've worked with over the years. If you do not have another starting point, this is a fantastic starting point. It takes away all the anxiety by giving exact instructions.